Hi everybody. Today I want to talk about security deposits. We've covered a lot of material up to this time, so you need to be aware of certain things when you're collecting your security deposit and a last month's rent. Now, a good landlord property manager, they're always seeking to collect a security deposit because it's your security, your insurance to make sure all the terms of lease are fulfilled. The deposit will make sure there is money available in the case of any damages left by the tenant after they move out. Now you need to explain to the tenant the security deposit is not the last month's rent and they cannot apply for that. They try to pull this all the time. With a security deposit, you now have money available to fix any damages after the tenant leaves. Another problem can occur when allowing a tenant to apply the security deposit to the last month's rent. You should never, ever do that. If a tenant requests you use the security deposit, you should treat this as non-payment. So here's what you should do. You should follow necessary steps for non-payment of rent. If after receiving the proper notice, the tenant has still not paid, then you must follow necessary legal steps to file for an eviction. Don't fool around with this. Tell the tenant the rent is rent and security deposit is security deposit. If they don't pay the rent, you'll have no choice but to file a three-day notice and start the eviction. So if you have any questions, comments, give me a call, cell phone, email. We're here to help. Thanks. Have a great day.